All right, Trip. You know, all kind of great cars here. What do you think it takes to pick out a winner? Uh, I think it takes, uh, you got to go by the heart. If you can't go with intellect, you can't go with your knowledge about engines and all that stuff that you think you know. You just got to go you with. That I think I know. That you think you know. Believe me, dude, I know. <laughs> Tom knows drag racing. See, like, I personally, I go with, like, cars that I grew up with, you know, like, like the Camaro, the SS Camaro. I see this sweet Mustang back here. It's a, uh, it's an SL482. Okay, now <laughs> you got your car here that's like your basic family car, but guess what? That's got a blower on it. And man, you just cannot beat that forced induction. That adds horsepower like you wouldn't believe. But you probably don't think horsepower has anything to do with it. Oh, I think horsepower has a lot to do with it. I don't think blowers have anything to do with it. Well, blowers create horsepower. Oh, do they really? Oh, yes. All right. See, I think you got to go with color. Color is important. Because I've heard that actually red cars sometimes go faster than white cars. No, you sound like my mom picking football teams. Oh, yeah, they've got nice uniforms. <laughs> or how I pick the uh, NCAA brackets. Well, their tight end's got a nice butt, so I'm going to pick that team. Uh, no, I'll go with has, that. I, I like that it theory. It has nothing to do with color. All right, so here's the, then what I think we ought to do is I think then put your money where your mouth is, and I think you go pick a car, I'll go pick a car. We'll do a little grudge match. We'll go head to head. Oh, I'm down for that, dude. You think you had your way on me on the go-kart track, but you didn't. So I think we got to step it up a notch here. Yeah, but see, we were on a road course then. This is a drag strip. This is where I oh, made look, my Oh, look, the drag boat. racing. Yeah, and we're <laughs> going to be doing some of that soon. All right, let's do it. Now this, this is a beautiful car. Hey, excuse me, you Jeff. How you doing? I'm Tripp with Open Throttle 360. Nice it's a beautiful you. car. Thank you. All right, here's the deal. Tom and I are co-hosts of Open Throttle 360. You're going head to head. It's a lot of pride riding on this, and basically he's out picking the car that he thinks is going to beat everybody. Would you be willing to go head to head at the start with uh, whoever Tom picks? Yeah, I don't care. Thanks, Jeff. Hi, I'm Tom Lang. I'm the host of Open Throttle 360. Uh, what's your name? Rich Moore. Rich, you uh, you looking to go up and do some racing? All right, I'm ready. I think she's going to run like a scalded dog. You, you realize now you can't lose because it's going to make <laughs> me look bad with Trip, And I usually beat Trip. So Let's don't, get her done. Don't let me down, okay? <laughs> All right. I did not see that coming. You didn't think a truck could take a car? Uh, no, I didn't. I didn't think a pickup truck could take a Mustang. Maybe it had something to do with those tanks that were in the back of it? Yes. Explain those, that to me, please. Those tanks were nitrous oxide. It's uh, a liquid supercharger. The more oxygen you put in the engine, the more fuel you can put in, bigger bang, more power. And you saw those before you picked uh, the car you wanted to win? Remember the discussion we had about how you pick Vaguely. cars? <laughs> I know how to pick them. I look for one head nitrous tanks. You didn't. All right. Well, once again, I'm, I'm coming up sloppy seconds. I and guess. you're buying lunch. Yeah. Okay. Whatever.